Hey guys, it is your girl Kim here, back with another video. And today I am going to be doing a review on the Maybelline Fit Me Foundation. Now, before I continue, go any further, I'm going to need you to hit that subscribe button, like this video, and you know what, leave a little comment down below just to tell me what you think about the video and whatever. <laughs> And you know, stay tuned for more because I got a lot more coming, B. And without further ado, let's just get right into the video. So a little background with me and this Maybelline foundation was, I believe I used to use it like two years ago. Well, three now. Um, and basically... What happened was they created the dewy and smooth finish and they cre um, created a whole new um, formula for the original one because I was using the Maybelline Fit Me foundation before there was a matte and poreless um, formula. And basically when they changed the um, matte formula, basically... It became too light for me and I couldn't find the shade that was good for my skin tone in the matte and poreless because of the formula change. So I was either I go online for it or I just try out different foundation and I ended up trying out different foundations. So this one is like an oldie but kind of a goodie if it works well on my skin tone for I do have oily slash combination type skin. So, I hope it stays matte. I hope it stays poreless. I hope, you know, it do what it say. So, let's just get right into it. The color that I chose was the 368 Golden Deep. Looks like this. I already primed my face with the um, Wet n Wild primer and camera and eye makeup has already been done off camera so let's just get right into it so I just dotted it all over my face and then right now it's looking a little light I hope it blends out better so let's just see the rest of my makeup and come back to you guys with my thoughts so coming back after you know the whole foundation putting on process I have to tell you that I am impressed with the madness now poreless it's going pretty well so far I do not like this crease but I feel like every time I wear makeup I always get this crease um I did set the whole face with the Airspun Translucent Powder, went back into contour, added highlight, and I'm going to say other than this crease and that it is coming up a bit ashy, it's on, a bit ashy on camera, but it also is a bit light in person, and that is 368 in the Fit Me Golden. 
um, in the dewy, the dewy and smooth of the um, Maybelline foundation, I do use about, I think it's, I think it's 360, and that's like nice, and sometimes it is a bit dark, so like that's kind of why I've been on that side for a little while. I don't know why a darker foundation is still like a little bit lighter. I think I'm just a, you know, a little, I'm a little dark just because, but you know what, that's okay. Full of melanin, bitch. My hair is fucking up in a bit, but it's okay. Full of